What's up, homies? I want to show you guys my favorite piece that I cut today. I cut it lengthwise because I thought I could get maybe a good picture out of it. And sure enough, I got the rhyolite for the dirt at the bottom, common opal at the top for the sky, and even a little bit of crushed up common opal and rhyolite mixed together getting compressed underneath the rhyolite there. So cool that I got that. I couldn't believe it. I felt so smart when I cut it open. I first started cutting at it and I was like, you know, just cut, cutting at it for a gemstone on the side. And I was like, well, maybe I could get a bigger picture out of it if I cut it lengthwise. So I'm glad I didn't go too far before I got that idea. It still looks cool like that, too. Having those corners exposed. We did cut some carnelian. That's cool. The one on the right's dry. The one on the left, I think I just had my arm on it, so it's probably wet whole bunch of other common opals with amazing pattern. So it shouldn't be in the mix. That's from Acton. Acton has really fine material that looks like it's been cut, even if it hasn't. Some more of those rhyolites floating around in there. Is this one cut? Cool patterns. These will all polish out into being nice pieces of jewelry or more like a picture jasper I'm gonna polish the face of that and it's gonna be really cool what we call it a picture rhyolite opal it's cool to have more than one material at once <laughs> 